Now, one of the most incredible things about this business, and I mean, it fascinates me to this very day, is how the business actually works. It's actually like a fluid, uh, like a liquid, okay? And there's unlimited amount of it. As much as you need, as much as you want to make, as much as other people want to make, there's enough of Market America fluid to go around. Now, if you can picture this reservoir of Market America fluid, it'll take on the form of whatever vessel you pour it into, whatever container you pour it into. So if you want something small and just a little extra income, it'll give you that, okay? If you want something that is going to bring in millions, it'll fill it and it'll give you that. If you want to make it hard and do it your own way and have to redo it, it'll give you that, okay? So whatever you want it to become, whatever you think that it is, it actually becomes, okay? I know that some people want quick money. You might be in an environment or a culture that goes after quick money. And usually, it doesn't work. And when you do hit, or when you do score, or when you do get lucky, it doesn't last. And you got to do it again. Well, Market America can take on the form of that vessel if that's the way you think about the business. And you can make some quick money, okay? <laughs> but the real reward here is residual income. You can learn how to do it relatively fast, and when you build it, it gives you residual income, repeating income, steady income, permanent income. So which vessel do you want to pour it into? Where do you want to go with it? Say, I recommend to you that you want to build this fast, but you want to build it for the long term, and you want to have big dreams, big visions, so that you have a big vessel. Let's see how it actually works in this incredible demonstration that shows you what Market America really is. This business is like a fluid, okay? It's like liquid. It's like water. It takes the form of whatever vessel, whatever container you pour it into. Market America becomes whatever a person sees it as, whatever they want it to be, whatever they're committed to. And there's as much Market America as you need, okay? I can fill up as many containers, okay, as I need to. There's unlimited amount of Market America. If we have another million people in the business, is there enough Market America for them all to succeed? Because they're not competing with anybody, are they? Okay? If you put another 10,000 people in your down line, is there enough Market America to supply all of them, to train all of them, to let them grow and earn $100,000 a year? So do you agree there's enough Market America for everybody? And it's the substance. So, but Market America is a liquid. It takes the form of whatever vessel I poured into. Now, some people just want to save some money on some products. They want to enjoy some products, have a little bit better health. They don't want that much out of it, okay? So that's what they get, okay? And it's, it's, it's fine. It's very nice. They just want a little teacup, okay? Somebody else wants a little bit more, okay? They want more products, and they sell one product every once in a while. Somebody else wants to have a retail business, okay? And there's absolutely nothing wrong with that. They're making 80 to $200 extra per month, but that's what they wanted and that's what they were willing to do, okay? Somebody else wants to put a couple people in the business and they'll work a little bit hard. They're putting just a little more time in it, okay? Uh, and then somebody else wants to earn $1,500 per week. So they work a little harder and they do a little bit more and they're committed and it takes on the form of the container I pour it into. Somebody else wants to earn $3,600 a week. And Market America, if they work it and do the business, will grow to take on the same form of that vessel, okay? Then some people have their own way of building the business. Okay, they think they're going to make a lot of money, but their program's all full of holes because they do it their own way. They won't listen. You know anybody like that? But it takes on the form of the vessel. They just got a leaky vessel, a leaky container. Okay? Then we have people okay, that have weird dreams. Some people's things that they want in Market America 
okay, what they want Mark and America to become is a little strange. I read a lot of goal statements. So you might have a container, or somebody in your group might have a container that's a little weird, a little strange. I got one person who said, I want to go full time and become a professional poker player and travel the world. Another one was 45 years old and said he wanted to become a ballerina. Another guy said, I want to start an ashram and meditate and duplicate it all around the world. Another one wanted to start a nudist colony. Another one said, I want to buy a luxury van and travel to every state and make love to my wife in every state. That's my goal. Whatever floats your boat, buddy. I mean, you're one of the weird ones. Another one said, I want to buy an alpaca farm and keep the animals for pets. I mean, whatever floats your boat. The thing is, Market America takes on the form of the container you pour it into. Some people look like they're full, okay, but they're really empty. And they have no Market America in them, okay? Then some people have big aspirations, and they're willing to work passionately and hard, okay? A field vice president, okay? And I can fill that up with that hose, okay? But you know what? I believe that the biggest earners haven't even come into Market America yet. I believe that if we go to work, there's going to be people earning millions per year. We already have a couple that are about there, one that is there, one is this on the brink of it. But I'm not going to rest, folks, until we fill an auditorium like this with directors and we have people making five, ten million dollars per year because it's possible. 